Welcome to Delivery Manager Tutorial. Under the Loan Manager tab, initiate Delivery Management Module. You can navigate delivery records if you like, start with a new delivery record. Like other modules, adding is similar. Begin by selecting the recipient of your delivery. Note all other details of the recipient will be added or filtered for you. Once individual is selected, change the location of delivery and select the single item you want to delivery. Note you can create deliveries for both, single and multiple items under a unique delivery UID. You can then select the date and, more importantly, time of delivery. Inventory Manager uses a 24-hour method for delivery scheduling. After you select the date and time, select who you want to deliver the item. Next, add in a reference number for tracking purposes, you can deliver for loans, maintenance and even disposal. So, reference is critical. Follow this entry by adding in notes so that your delivery personnel know what to do. Confirm delivery and note the reference UID. Like other modules you can navigate your delivery data for that particular entry for verification. Delivery manager can manage multiple items but processes on a single item basis. As such, it is entirely possible for a single delivery UID to contain various items and each of these delivery entries could be partially or fully fulfilled as needed by a potential scenario. Deliveries are contingent to approval. Go ahead and approve your entry. Once confirmed, you can head to the Due Deliveries tab and note that your entry has now been added as part of the Due Deliveries list. All approved deliveries are due until delivery. You can find the item in the listing. Refer to the listing. To deliver, you will have to select the personnel who has received your item and then proceed to press the deliver button. Once delivered, your item will be updated. You can also use a barcode scanner to search for an entry and then press the delivery button. The record will be updated as delivered. Items after delivery are loaned, reserved or available. For bulk deliveries, in the bulk delivery requests click begin bulk delivery button and select your recipient. You can then search the items you wish to deliver under a single delivery UID. Double click items to select them. You can double click an entry to select it for delivery and then you can also double click the added item to remove it from your delivery request UID. Do note that while you add items, only those added on the right are deliveries. After addition or omission, add in the date and time of delivery. It is important to mention the time of delivery to be mentioned. For inventory manager, in delivery module, a 24-hour format is used. Next add in a reference number. If you have arranged a delivery from another module, one will be generated for you. For a custom case, add one for tracking followed by some comments for your delivery personnel. If you verify your entry, you will find that your entries are now grouped under a single delivery UID. You can group your deliveries but have to manage them on an individual basis. This allows for partial deliveries in the system. Also note that both items need to be delivered at the same time but can be delivered late. However, the delivery record if exceeds the request, will be recorded. You can easily search your deliveries via your unique UID. Inventory Manager uses a standardized interface. That means, if you operate at a fairly competent level in one module, you should easily recognize similar elements in another. You can perform searches. You can search deliveries by recipient names, UIDs, or locations. Like in other modules, yielded searches can be further assessed by double-clicking the entries. This ends the basics of Delivery Management Module in Inventory Manager.